Welcome, welcome, welcome. What is up, guys? Welcome back to our channel. And we're back, back with, with another, another video. video. So, guys, today's video, we're going to be doing um, a question and answer. Q&A. So, we asked you guys on the community, and I also posted on my story, ask us some questions. So, we're just going to read the questions and then give you all the answers. The first question that we got was... Um, when is the cooking channel going to be here? By Wavy Kenley. Is that his name on YouTube? Yes, it is. Wavy Kenley, our like number one supporter. One Him of our number one supporters. Kevin Saburo. All right, so when are we going to start our cooking channel? That's what he asked? Yeah. Um, I don't think I want to start a cooking channel. How about you? I don't know. I feel like since we just have the series on our channel and a playlist, mm -hmm. I feel like that's enough because the whole cooking channel is just like... Extra? It's like starting over. Yeah. I don't know. Um, maybe when we're like at a million subscribers on our main channel, then maybe if we get some subscribers from that to go over to the cooking channel, maybe we'll do something like that. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. If you could restart your life from any age with all your knowledge, would you do it? And what age would you be? Yes, I would do it. 110%. Yes. What age would you be? I'll go back to <clears throat> fourth grade. Because that's when oh, I first great. came to America. Yeah. With all my memories, with all my knowledge, bro. I'll be crazy. How about you? I wouldn't do it. You wouldn't go back? No. Sheesh, all this knowledge. Because I wouldn't want all the grief that I went through again. Whoa. It would just make it worse. Because I already know it's going to happen. Yeah, but you you probably spend more time with them, right? I spent as much time as I could, though. Oh, okay. So um, it would just make it worse. It would just make it harder. I mean, I think you could change some stuff, right? No. Yeah. I think I'd definitely go back. I wouldn't change a lot, but I definitely would have, like, change i don't know i would mess up the whole time <laughs> you definitely would yeah. what do you think about the medium rare steak oh medium rare steak when i first bit into it it was it was delicious it was the yeah. best steak i've one of the best steak the wagyu was number one wagyu it was is. one of the best steak i ever had perfectly seasoned it was juicy but it was it was chewy though people say the well done is chewy but the medium rare was chewy too. Yeah, I feel like uh, medium rare is a little chewier than well done to yeah. me. Yeah, but yeah, it was really good. I definitely don't want to try it again because it made me sad while I was eating it. <laughs> felt like I was eating something alive and I didn't like that. So I almost cried <laughs> eating that junk too. Are you guys going to get married or are you dating for experience? Experience, what the heck? Dating for experience, we've been together for dang near four years now. Mm -hmm. So in like two days? Yeah. Two days is going to make our fourth year together, our four-year anniversary. If we was dating for experience, that's a waste of time. Yeah, I'm not dating for experience. That is a waste of time. Honestly, I don't even want to start over. <laughs> it's crazy. Nah, that's too... Nah, I don't even... That's it. No more. <laughs> All right, so we dating to get married. Okay, next question. How did y'all meet? Five people asked us this question. Yeah. So um, we met in high school mm -hmm. at a dance recital yep after a track meet well my track meet i was running the tickets because i was in a dance class and i was like my teacher's assistant so i was um giving out tickets and taking the money and he came in <laughs> from his track meet because i was running back and forth so somebody called me up to the front because i guess we had like little i don't know if we had walkie talkies or something mm -hmm. but they called me up to the front and they're like, um, he's trying to buy a ticket. And I look at him, and he's just all 32 teeth in my face, yeah. smiling mad hard. And Damn. I'm like, do you have $5? He's like, oh, no, I only got a dollar. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm like, you can't get in if you only have a dollar. So he's like, oh, all right. And then later that night, he DMs me. <laughs> Yo, I don't even think that's how it happened. Get out of it here. It is how it happened. Later that night, you. he DMs me saying, Oh, hey, I saw you at the recital. Guys, that makes no sense. How do how do I see you, talk to you, but then go home and say I saw you? You did that. I did not do that. That don't make if no I sense. If I still had the DMs, y'all. Get out of here. I would show y'all, but that's literally what you did. Come on, y'all. That make no sense. That's literally what I you did. I don't remember. I don't remember that. <laughs> she remembers it, but I don't. But prior to that, prior to that night, I um I said, hey, turn on Instagram. So, what, Siri? <laughs> I'm like, wait. Yeah, guys, but prior to that night, um, I said what's up to her on Instagram, so... You did yeah. not say what's up. What'd I say? Y'all, I posted... No, you don't even gotta say that. I just said what's up, guys. 
Come on, y'all. Get out of here. We don't got to do all that. <laughs> That's oh, it. my God. Next question. Oh, that was a, the same question. How did you meet each other and what made it work? That's that's how you say it? Sasuke, yeah. She don't remaster. What's oh. the question? He said, well, she or he said, um, how did you meet and what made it work? But we already answered the first part. Yeah, what made it work? Yeah. Patience, hard work, and consistency. And communication. Yes, definitely. Oh, yeah. How did I forget that? I have no idea. Communication. Communication is, is key. And forgiveness, too. You got to forgive. Oh, next question is from John. Mm-hmm. Dang, so we might as well say everybody's name. Michael Mays, EAD BDR, um, Wavy Canley, TikTok Life 101, Shido Remaster, and who else? Um, This one. Entitled, Entitled Dreamer. Dreamer. And what do we saw about? This one. But we got to do. We just be about to do this one. But so the last one is John. Yeah, but we okay. Didn't say so his name. re underscore tb tbp seven five seven. There's all the questions that we got, and shout out to you guys for asking the questions too, because you guys made the video possible. So thank you. Yes. Um. So the question we were about to answer was, what was the from again? John. Oh, uh, John. And it okay. said, "Are you guys thinking about kids? And if so, names." Kids, of course. Names, yeah. I'm not sure yet. Names, I have them in my head. But I don't know if I want to use them. <laughs> yeah, they're going to change in the future. <laughs> um, okay, now All let's... right, so that was the community questions. Now we're going to go on Instagram, right? Yes. Instagram had a couple questions, too. So we're not going to answer all the questions on Instagram? How many did you have? Um, I don't know. I think probably the same amount. Okay. Uh, what do y'all love the most about each other? Mm. Um, Imagination. Like, she's always talking about the future, houses, this and that. And I like that. A lot, cause I, I like it. Kind of motivates me and make me like look forward to something. And you eat a lot, <laughs> <laughs> so we always cooking something. <laughs> <laughs> you have to put me on the spot like that. Right, He's so funny, y'all. I'm not even funny, y'all. Yeah, he don't even try, and he be mm-hmm. having me in tears. Like when I say tears, like on the floor, can't breathe tears. <laughs> yeah. And yeah. he's like so smart when it comes like to money management wise. He helps me budget myself when um, when I need to. Yeah. And, yeah, I can't think anymore right now. Right, what's the next um, is Janique annoying? Um, her attitude is annoying. That's it. Yeah, that's it. Her <laughs> attitude. She be, yo, when she get aggravated, it's over. I hate that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's crazy. But, yeah, that's it. That's the only thing that's annoying. Um, what about what, oh no, that was is Janique annoying? Okay, next one is Do Bernie be annoying you? Yes, he do. How when I'm sleeping, he wake me up, bro. She be sleep till 12 o'clock. I don't wake you up no more, right? Sometimes you do. Oh my goodness, <laughs> Who's Bernie? who the heck is that? <laughs> Bernie's Burgos, who is that? Who is who has that? Oh. Uh. I'm not sure yet. I'm gonna have to surprise Wait, you. Wait, we didn't even read the question. Oh, you, go ahead, go ahead. You want to read it? No, you read it. <laughs> So one of my friends asked this, and I don't know why she calls him this. She said, when is Bernice Burgos going to propose? <laughs> That's going to be a surprise. So I'm going to just say I'm not sure yet. How do you guys maintain a healthy relationship? You go first. Yeah, like I said before, communication. Mm-hmm. Definitely patience. Because mm-hmm. sometimes you and your partner are going to get on each other's nerves. Yeah, exactly. Like a lot. Yes, a well, lot. You haven't gone on my nerves in like a long time though. A couple of months. Yeah, so basically when she kind of like gets me mad, we commun- I get mad first, take a little break. Not a break, a space. I take space, okay? We just, I stay here, lay down, and just calm down. And then we, we just talk don't, about we it. We just don't talk for him. Yeah, because I don't want to say down. nothing. I don't want to say nothing. I regret it. She doesn't want to say anything. She'll regret it. So after that, we just talk about it. I tell her what I didn't like. And then we just work on it. And after that, we just don't argue about it no more. Going on a lot of dates. Yeah. Keeping the um the fun. that kinda keeps us the fun and looking everything. forward to stuff. Yeah. yeah. Traveling. Well we plan on traveling, so that kinda keeps things yes. interesting. If you ever go to school and, and think like you have a partner for a project, it's basically what it is. You have a partner in life to help you with everything. So you don't gotta go through it all. Yeah, by yourself. So basically that's that's how I think. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Hopefully this video was entertaining or you guys enjoyed it or got some answers to like some of the questions you want answered like the maintain a healthy relationship mm-hmm. if you guys got more questions let us know in the comments if you guys want to see another q on it 
Yeah. Thank you so much for watching once again. If you guys enjoyed, please make sure to leave a like, comment, and if you're new to our channel, subscribe. Subscribe. And we'll see you guys in our next video. Peace. Peace.